I want to follow up on a question that both Peter and Weijia asked you yesterday about sure. the, how this president views the Justice Department yep. as independent. There have been a number of instances where the president has said publicly that he's either instructed or asked or directed the Justice Department to do different things. Is it, where do you draw the line when you say the Justice Department is, is making independent decisions? Uh, investigations, that's where they make independent decisions. There's policy making where there can be discussion, but investigations, which historically, prior to the last administration, the Department of Justice has always had independent purview of, uh, that is what the President expects, what the Attorney General expects, and what we will continue to deliver on. The President said on October 7th he instructed the Justice Department to make sure that we deal with the violence on aircraft. Uh, he uh, issued an executive order on July 9th having to do with antitrust encouraging, all but directing, the Attorney General to vigorously enforce it. Uh, he uh, said on July 13th the Justice Department would double its enforcement of the Voting Rights Act. Are you describing these things as policy determinations? Uh, I Well, look, Steve, I think the important thing also to, co to convey accurately to people who listen to you is when announcements were made by the Department of Justice, and sometimes the President comments on them after those announcements were made, which I think was a case in at least one of those examples you gave. And yes, there are criminal investigations or investigations that are the under the independent purview of the Justice Department, something that will continue to be under the independent purview of the Justice Department under this administration. And that is different from what was done over the last four years.